Got another one. Good morning, guys. This is CLS, and welcome to Adventure Bro Fishing. I'm headed to meet up with my fishing partner, Evan White, and we're going to head to Surfside to enjoy free fishing day in Texas. Every first Saturday in June, every year, you can fish without a fishing license. So I'll say we're fishing legally illegal or is it illegally legal i don't know but catch us on our next adventure stay tuned Something was just on it. You saw it, it's back on it. You saw it, I missed it though. Oh no, I got him. A whiting, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Man, I've been wanting to get out here and catch a whole bunch of whiting like that too. Yeah. We're gonna throw a gulp swimming mullet on this jig head. Get this guy set up, ready for us to throw out. You get him, man? Is that Kroger? Oh, come on. Come on, Evan. That is not what the fuck I'm he's, he's not even hooked right. I
You got one too? You got a whiting, I got a catfish. Not a bad size whiting. Huh? I, I saw that. I saw when it, when your pole was bent all the way over. So whiting? Good. Oh yeah, that's gonna keep that's a good that's the biggest one maybe we caught all day. I just missed one. I just missed missed one on this goat. Yep. Okay, I only brought I brought another spare jig hand in case I lose this one. Oh yeah, they're tearing that gulp up. They're tearing that gulp up. Nothing big though. It look. It just ain't more of the tail. Oh. are working. That's not a croak my joke. That's a croak my joke. Bull red, bro. Had to be. Did you not see the fin? Yeah, I saw you it. You saw it? In the and in the back. Yeah. Whoa. Cool. 
cool, cool. Black drum, black drum. Oh, he's gut hooked. Oh man. Oh my God. Oh, I hate when they get hooked so deep. So fun. I'm, I don't know. Let's see. I, I need to see him first, but he just took off. And he's up on these piling, up on these bush heads. Now nah, I don't, I won't need the net. But it's a, it's a beautiful little red, man. Multiple spots. Come on, man. Got another one. You said you had a, but you already caught one? Oh, this, I caught one like this here before. Yeah. yeah. Sure yep. Look at this. Yeah, no, I know. Right there, oh, that. Snap. I barely got him in. Man. That's pretty. He might make it. That'd be close. That's pretty good. Pretty fish. Damn. Where? Oh, my other rod. I have a. I know my other rod has a um. On the reel. On the on the Where rod. Casting at. Mind your business. <laughs> nah, just right, right at that corner. Mm -hmm. Probably uh six feet to the left of the tip. Mm -hmm. Well, let's see what he is eighteen inches he's not gonna make it Saturday out in Texas and we've caught a full spread. Get a close up here. We've got some whiting. We've got some croaker. And we've got, I don't know. Guys, comment below what this is. Comment below whatever this is. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a cleaning process of the whiting. So I'm gonna fillet one of the whiting so you can see you know how to do it. Alright? So if you come a little closer, we'll be, we'll be right here. Just angle it down and that'll be like that so what you're gonna do you're gonna come in and these are one of the easiest fish to clean there's no size limit there's no you know bag limit it's not a game fish it's just a you know a bait fish but they're one of the best eating fish in salt water I'm gonna just cut right behind this gill plate and that front fin I'm gonna flip that around I'm gonna come in get my knife right there I'm gonna cut through the rib bones because the rib bones are very fair it doesn't make any sense to try and, you know, cut around the rib bones because you can just cut them out. Now once that's done, I'm just going to come out, turn my blade, and just push through. Push through. That's a fillet. Now you can come in here, cut out those rib bones, cut out those, take those fins, and that's one whiting fillet. Now what we'll do, we'll go around, cut this other side. Same thing. We're gonna turn it. We're gonna get up underneath, feeling against that backbone. Flip that fillet over. Cut those rib bones out. And then 
right here, we've got two boneless fillets of whiting. And we're gonna take this and throw that away. So guys, check that out. Two boneless fillets of whiting. And we're gonna do a cook on this later on. We may fry it up, we may pan fry it, we may blacken it, but we'll see you guys later. Adventure bro, till we are in the kitchen. All right, and we're back. Now we're in the kitchen, and we're gonna be cooking up some clean whiting fillets. We're gonna just do a very basic, very simple seasoning. We're gonna get with my dad, Tony. We're gonna get my man, Cayenne, and some regular black ground pepper. And it's gonna be just a light seasoning. We're not gonna overdo it, okay? That's one side, a little bit of my man, Cayenne. some black pepper. Now be sure that you get both sides so we're gonna flip this over. A little bit more of my dad Tony. My man Cayenne. And some ground black pepper. Next thing we're gonna do is get some extra virgin olive oil because what we're gonna do today is we're gonna air fry it. In the air fryer, I put it on for 400 degrees in 12 minutes. So just gonna lightly spray both sides. Get an even coating. And then we're gonna put it in this air fryer on this pan. So what this pan allows me to do is take it out and actually get my spatula. Let me grab my spatula. Allows me to take it out of this air fryer, get my spatula and get under those fillets. Because if you look in this air fryer, there's not really a way to get under there properly. You're gonna break up the fish and everything. So. We're just going to go ahead and fold this back up. We're going to drop it in there. Okay. 400 degrees. Let's say 10 minutes because these whiting fillets are a little thin. So 400 degrees for 10 minutes and we'll be back when it's done cooking. Now my fish is almost done cooking. Say hello to my dogs, Coco and Chanel. Hey Chanel. Hey Coco. So let's see what we're working with. those two fillets up. Now what I've got over here is some Hawaiian bread, some lettuce, some cherry tomatoes, and a slice of jalapeno cheese. We're gonna put those both on there like that. We've got a secret little sauce, a spicy sandwich spread. I'm gonna go ahead and Put over these tomatoes. Lay my lettuce on top. Bam. It's better than a fish fillet from McDonald's. Let me get something better. Go. 
Let's see how it tastes. Mmm. That's really good, guys. Whiting is so tender of a fish. Don't overcook it. You end up drying it out. There may be a few little pin bones. Just crunch right through them. Well, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. See you next time on our next adventure. This is Adventure Bro, signing out.